Welcome back. In today's video, I am going to show you something amazing we do with our Google Apps Script, which is for your easiness. So right now you have seen our Google Apps Script URL like that. So you can see here in Manage Deployment and click on Manage Deployment. Right now we have access our Google Apps Script web app from this URL. I just copy it and paste it here. Right now we have uh, access our URL like this. So what we do if we can make our URL like that in free of cost. So let's break down. Before starting the video, you need to click on the subscribe button and press on the bell icon and in comment you must write a done. Okay. So for this, you need to have a GitHub account. Okay. For this, you need to have a GitHub account. So open your GitHub account when I'm going to click on my GitHub account and click on this setting and uh, click on this code. So right now the code I will leave in the description. I just copy this code from here because right now this is the code which I will see here. So you just need to, I, I will leave the code in the description. You what you need to do before you doing this. Okay, I will explain you everything. You just need to click on the setting icon and click on this your repositories. When you are come in your repository sections, you just need to click on this new. When you click on this new, you can enter any kind of name. It's related to you, uh, what you want. I will enter my demo one. So this is available. Make sure it will be public. And when you click on this create repository, it will be created successfully. So now you just need to click on this create a new file and you just need to click on this create a new file and name him a index.html and the code i given you in the description in the description uh you just paste it here and you can also take a screenshot and write it yourself okay so now what you do uh so now here what you need to do bro so whenever you are going to embed so whenever you are going to embed you just need to Click on your manage deployment and just copy your URL. Just copy your this URL. And uh, here, come here and just replace with your web app URL and paste it here. And when you paste it here, you just need to click on this comment changes. And one thing before doing that, if you want to change this embed content, you if you want to change this embed content text, so you can also change from here i will change it with mri and uh, right now I, I will show you a demo first because it's of officially working from this i just copy this and i enter a password for your easiness because it's managed from your google drive i just copy this and paste it here and click on this login when i am going to click on this login so now you can see here loading Please wait. So now we are successfully logged in and we have no this application was created by uh, uh, Google Apps Script user. You will see I have no pop up like that. So uh, we just need to click on this comment changes and click on this comment change. And uh, now you can see here they uh, successfully comes. And now we need to go to our settings sections. And I'm going to go to settings sections. So now here you need to go to your pages sections in the drop down. You can see here the pages and select here the main branch. And when you click on this main and just click on this save icon. When you click on this save icon, go to your code section. And right now you will see here a yellow dot. When you click on this yellow dot and click on this details. So now you can see here it will be checking all the things of your web app. Okay, it will checking all the things of your, about your web application. So this method is only for those who cannot afford a domain from the registrars of GoDaddy and hosting. Uh, this is absolutely free method to deploy your web app like this kind of URL for your easiness uh, instead of this bulky kind of URL. So it will take time and when it complete, you just need to go to your setting and uh, click on this pages. And when you click on this pages, you can have uh, your demo and you just need to click on this. So you can now see here your Google web app is successfully embedded in your, in your Google apps, in your GitHub URL. So now it will also connect to your custom domain of your GoDaddy. And if you want that also, 
any kind of your domain registrar, dog, go daddy, and hostinger, uh, any kind of. If you want to connect with them with a subdomain, you can leave a comment. Minimum 50 comments. If I receive, I will purchase a I will purchase a domain and make a video on that for you guys. So take care. Meet you in our next video.